Hey everyone, so I just woke up a little bit ago. Right now I'm just watching some YouTube. I always watch YouTube videos. Um, I just thought I'd start the vlog now and I'm about to open my calendar, so I'll show you guys that. And the first one is where's the number three? Here we go. I always have to put them down when I open them because like and there's the little chocolate. So here's number three. And then I'm about to open number three of this one. This one I can't stand up. I don't know why this one, the chocolates keep falling. Like, it's really annoying. I'm trying to open this up. Ooh, and here's a little mirror. Here's me. I honestly really need, like, a little purse mirror. I don't have one. This is really pretty. It's like a baby blue with the gold. I really like it. And that was number three. Hey everyone, so I'm back home, and me and my brother had to um go help my dad pick something up. I'm about to eat lunch, and I'm watching Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. The first one cracks me up because like it's just funny to me when he's like he tells him he how he tells him like you get nothing, you lose. Good day, sir. But this ain't the first one. This is the second one that's on right now. But yeah, I don't know what else I'm doing today. I think we might look for decorations because we have some in the basement, but we don't know where they are exactly. And then put them out. Okay. I was cleaning our room and I received a visit from this creature. But look what she's doing. She was, ooh. She's sitting on my shoulder. Complete, I have a hand on her, but look. She's literally sitting on my shoulder like a parakeet or something. Like, what is she doing? You parakeet, are you? You bird? Are you bird? All right, Bella. She is not participating. She is apparently no longer speaking to me. Why, Bella? But then again, I did have pancakes and bacon a minute ago, and she kept begging me for bacon. She's like, you didn't share any bacon with me, so I'm not talking to you, and yeah. I got in my pajamas. I honestly love these pajamas because then they have little sheep on them, like different like textured sheep. I need to turn this down because I'm watching Dexter. I want Dexter's laboratory just in the background of me just in my room. But I'm about to do my skincare and I think I'll show you guys that. But I do love these pajamas, like I said. These are like one of my favorite ones. I don't have a mirror anymore because my cousin borrowed my mirror for like a day and the day turned into like a lifetime and then she broke it so that kind of sucks i need to get a new mirror though so i can't show you guys my whole pajamas and i'm being clawed by this thing right here hi bella she don't like the camera so i'm gonna wash my face and what i'm gonna use is I think I'm gonna use my little mini soy fresh face cleanser thing. And I'm gonna use my toner. These ultra premium cotton pads are so good from CVS. Like everyone talks about the Shiseido ones. I haven't tried those, but these are so soft and nice, and they're like three fifty or something. They're a little bit more expensive for cotton rounds, but it's a pack of one hundred fifty, and they're really good quality, and they don't fall apart like other ones. Just because my skin's like so dry, I'm gonna use this Pearlescence coconut water hydrating mist and um now I'm gonna use my aloe pure time repair serum and I switched between this and rosehip oil but I ran out of my rosehip oil and anyway this one has AHA in it so it's a little bit it helps you a little bit exfoliating and my skin honestly needs that right now. On top of that, I'm going to put on my Cetaphil Moisturizing Lotion. Not a lot because honestly, 
that's pretty moisturizing on its own. On my Moistful Eye Cream from Etude House, and I really honestly really like this eye cream. You only need to tap into the jar like one time. Like one small tap. And I'm not trying to flick you guys off. And like most eye creams I've used, like I've used a couple of creams that really irritated my eyes. And this one doesn't from a Tude House. And it's only like $13 or something. And then I'm going to put on this um, Cocoa Butter and Aloe Lip Balm. In the Lemongrass scent from Moni Squared. And if I have any acne, which I honestly do have like a couple right now. Then I'll put this on it, which is the Neutrogena Rapid Clear Stubborn Acne Daily Leave-On Mask. I don't put this on in the daytime because I feel like even when my skin's oily, if I put this on in the daytime, it makes my makeup look dry on top of my skin for some reason. I only use this on top if I have like a really bad pimple, but I'm just going to put this right here because I don't know if you guys can see that like ugly thing. The rest of this on my cheek is mostly just scarring and oh my god you can see it really good on the camera I can't even see it as good in real life I think it's the lighting I have is making it look so pink and it's really genuinely in person not that pink and that's my nighttime skincare routine I just wanted to show you guys that because I didn't really do much today I'm gonna go to bed soon and I'm just gonna end the vlog here